Hey, Steve. Hey, Tim. You're an hour late. Yeah, sorry. Unavoidable delay. It'll come out of your wages. Oh, well. You're the boss. Well, now you're here, you can sort out your best mate. I've got things to do. So, Steve, you got a taste for it now, then, or what? Oh, one of the uh, drivers give me a dead cert for this afternoon. So, couldn't you wake up? I don't know. Fuck with the lark, mate. Put me offering for this place. Straight to the bank. Secured the finance, if only he knew, eh? What do you want finance for? You got the cash? Oh, no, I want a loan, just in case all the punters suddenly get lucky. Just like I did. <laughs> you only got lucky because you put your hand in the safe. Yeah, I know. Hey, look, that's Lucas's money. He's going to get all that back. Who were you, Robin Hood? No, he was dead into that redistribution of wealth and social justice. I, on the other hand, Steve, just want Shelley back on my arm. Stop what you're doing, listen up. Oh, something exciting happening. Not for you. I've just had a phone call from head office. They've accepted a firm offer for the business. What, a big offer than yours? Yeah. So, it's going to be all changed round here? Oh, don't worry, mate. You'll cope, you're all right. <laughs> you won't have to. I'm giving you your cards. What, both of us? No, you. I'll pay you to the end of the week. No, then, Rob, that's victimisation. <laughs> no, Peter, that's last in, first out. Anyway, I don't trust you. Ah, it's because you think I stole your rotten money, innit? Eh? Yeah, I do. It's a slingy rook. Here's what you wrote. Oh, no bonus. If it was up to me, you wouldn't be getting a penny. That's me, coat, mate. You know what? You are a very bitter man, Rob Luke. You're pointing the finger at me, and you've got no proof. Thanks, mate. Get out. Count yourself lucky. Same again, Shell, and have one for yourself. Uh, I won't, thanks. Hey, come on, look, don't be like that. I'm not being like anything. <laughs> anyway, you're arrogant enough for the pair of us. No, I'm happy. This is a smile you can see on my face. What for? You nicked somebody else's money. I've just been sacked, and Lucas took great pleasure in showing me that door. That's my honesty. <laughs> well, he's a very perceptive man, isn't he? No, he's an idiot. And he's £5,000 out of pocket. He's going to get that money back. When? As soon as possible. And then I can really enjoy that look on his face. What look? That one when he gets introduced to the new owner. And then he finds out it's me. Well, we do. Look, come on, he's going to get that money back, shall I promise you? And then everything's sorted, you'll go back out with me, won't you? It'll never happen. Look, take the notice of Shelley, it's not even her money. <laughs> no, it's not my money neither, is it? Why don't you put it through his door? Because I don't know where he lives. Well, then leave it on the counter. Or somebody might pick it up. Put it in his safe. Well, then he'd know it's me, wouldn't he? <sighs> I don't even know why you're bothering. If it was me, I'd have spent it by now. Lucas sometimes parks his car outside the bookies, doesn't he? Yeah, smash window chucking him. Well, yeah, I could do. I mean, he works late tonight. There you go. Two pints, please. Coming up. Problem solved. Right. If I mess this up, I'm going to be in real big trouble here. But sort your head out, will you? Do you want to do it? I can't be trusted with a wad of money, me. Ask anyone. Right, I'm gonna do it. Enjoy your evening. <laughs>